Hey, what's going on everybody? Manny back again with another grind workout for you guys today. Today I'm going to focus on chest. Uh, like I said in the last video, we're going to be going up to pyramid uh, training this week. So we're going to start with chest today. I got three or four exercises, same thing. Try to focus on being at eight, anywhere between eight to as much as 12 repetitions. I'm going to be increasing the weight. You don't necessarily have to do that. And it's going to get started right now. All right, we're back. We're gonna get ready with set number one. We're gonna do dumbbell presses for three sets for as much as anywhere between 12 to as low as eight repetitions. I will be increasing the weight with each uh, additional set. So the first set here. Get ready to go, here we go. Now you take as much time as you need. If you need a minute, you need a minute. I feel pretty good, so I'm gonna go right ahead and tackle set number two. I went up by 10 more additional pounds, so I'm up to about 40 pounds per dumbbell. So it's gonna be 80 pounds here. Set number two, you need to get at least 10. Would love to get 12, and uh, if I can get more than that, then I know I can definitely go up and wait in the next uh, set. Just set them up and ready to go. All right. I'm gonna give myself a nice little stretch, give me another 30 seconds. And I'm gonna hit this one. This is when you start grinding. This is, this is when you really start getting the gains. All right, I'm gonna push this. This is 50 pounds. So this is 100 pounds altogether. I will stabilize my feet. As you've seen, I have my legs up. I like to balance myself and do that, but when it starts getting a little bit heavier, don't take any chances unless you really have your strength there. Get your feet down on the ground and stabilize yourself. All right, set number three. Dumb. Oh yeah. Here we go. Ah. And go. somebody who hasn't done really some significant training in a long, long time. I haven't done chest bench presses like that, dumbbell presses, because I stick to dumbbells now as I'm older, you know, to prevent any injuries. So I won't be doing any barbell, barbell exercises here on this channel, but I will be doing a lot of exercises with cables, resistance bands, and of course with dumbbells. All right, I think that's good. I think I'm gonna do another one. I feel good. I'm gonna do another one with this actual same weight uh, for another 10 reps, and then we're gonna go to an incline, all right? Again, take it slow. Don't try to, it's like they say, man, Rome wasn't built in a day. Neither is, neither is your body, especially when you're trying to get back into shape. Take it a day at a time, get plenty of rest, get plenty of sleep, 
Make sure you take your fluids, drink your water, eat well, be on top of your micros. That's the most important thing. What works for me, high protein, lower carbohydrates as I progress through my training. And then you'll, you'll start seeing that in a couple weeks from now, I'll be a little leaner, a little tighter, and obviously a little bit more energy, strength, and the endurance will be there as well. So give it time. All right, let's go. Fourth set. <clears throat> we got to go for it. Oh, shit. Yeah. Grind time. Here we go. Whoa. Two. son Jacob back there he is a Fortnite complainer he just you hear him the kid is amazing everybody's a bot everybody's cheating it's a loser all right it's a good thing I'm not like that he, he didn't get that from me but he's very competitive I am competitive as well but not a sore loser so we're gonna adjust the weight. We're going to an incline now. Now, with the incline, I am gonna do incline dumbbell presses as well as incline flies. I like doing incline flies a little bit more, at least at this stage of my life, than doing flat bench incline, uh, flat bench flies. So we're gonna drop the weight a little bit here, or, or incline. All right. Whew. Just feeling good, make sure you get some stretches in between sets. And of course, get water if you need it. Because you are trying to train here and try to really get as much as you can get out of yourself for every set that you do. You definitely want to give yourself the time necessary to get your heart rate down a little bit. It was supposed to be a cardio session with pyramiding up. We want to have enough energy to tackle that next set with as much energy as we can. And if we need to get that heart rate down, just so we can be able to push through those reps a little bit more better, then you do that. Woo! Just make sure that you just get yourself moving, man. The grind is damn real. All right, let's go. Incline presses. There. Oh. What? Hold on. Get, make sure you're comfortable here. There you go. Set number two. Uh, oh yeah. This bench. Gonna have to give myself a better bench. Here we go. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. Uh, woo. Right now this is good. Get one more set. I'm gonna only do three and go right into the incline fly. Then I think I might be doing a pullover. Um, or maybe fi finish it off with some push-ups. One or the other. Let's see how I feel at the end of the third set. After the third set of the incline flies. Grind time, here we go. Alright. 
Oh man, that was great. Now comes those inclines. Those I haven't done in a while. I'm gonna take it a little easy. I will be dropping this weight for the first set. Ooh. Done this so many times, up and down with fitness. Fit, not fit, getting back into fitness, getting back to a workout routine. It's brutal, and then that I'm older now, it makes it even much more difficult. But, again, like I say all the time, hashtag, no excuses. There's no excuses. Make something happen. Move. Even if you're just gonna walk, walk your dog, whatever. Whatever the case may be. I prefer to jog on the treadmill, do a little run at the park. When it comes to heavy cardio, hit the punching bag, stuff like that I'll be doing. And of course, I'll share that with you guys as well. A lot of catastatic stuff, push-ups on top of the dumbbells, so. But it is all hard work. Again, if nothing was easy, if everything was easy, right, everybody would be in great shape and everybody would be wealthy and healthy. And uh, unfortunately, that is not the case. We all have to do our part. So, let me stop talking. Let's get to this next set, all right? All right, flies now. A little light on the weight, because uh, again, I don't want to injure myself. Take it slow. But enough resistance that you feel it. factor getting back into shape getting those heart and lungs so make sure you move man that's all I have to say ladies and gentlemen just make sure you move we all have busy lives we have children grandchildren whatever the case may be we're busy we have to make time God knows I made so many excuses to not stay fit and this is from somebody who used to be a fitness trainer for the greater YMCA's of New York back in my mid 20s, early 20s. So it's a disappointment, <laughs> you know, to know as much as I know about fitness and not exercise regularly. So set number two, let's go. Grind continues. Number two. set right now I'm feeling like I might push some sit-ups I mean, excuse me not sit-ups uh, I gotta get to those at some point but uh, push-ups I think I'm gonna finish it off with some push-ups today I haven't done push-ups in about four or five days so I think I want to do three sets of push-ups maybe 20 to 25 maybe as many as 30 per set I won't do 10 push-ups for you guys anybody can do 10 so I'm not gonna do sets of 10. It'll be more like 20, 25, possibly 30. Let's see how I feel. Here we go, finishing touches with the dumbbells today. Before we finish up, maybe the next time I'll do pullovers. I'm not too convinced with this bench as far as doing pullovers. Uh, so I'll stick to the push-ups, which will probably better for us anyway. Here we go. Grind set number three. I will go one more. My mind is telling me to do one more. 
but I definitely want to do the push-ups as well. So I don't want to get too carried away. And I advise you to do the same. If you're following along, if you're following along and doing this type of routine at home because you got dumbbells, take it slow. Okay? Push-ups, but I'm aiming for 25, 30. So if I feel good at 20 and I can do it, I'll go. If not, then I'll stop at 20. Okay, here we go. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. I am pushing my luck. Twenty's good, I felt that. Woo! Chest is mighty pump, man. That is good. That is good. <sighs> Mind over matter. <sighs> Mind over matter. Let's be grinders. Let's grind this shit out. But I'm not pushing my luck and going at it right away. So you can see I'm taking my time. Make sure I'm recuperating enough so I can hit it hard again for 20. Because remember, when you're doing push ups, you basically are pushing your own body weight. And I'm over 220 right now, trying to get myself down under 200. So like I said the other day, I'm about 20 pounds overweight or 20 pounds that I would love to see come off of me. Slowly but surely, not in a rush, but over the course of the next few months. So if you're pushing 220, you're basically are doing some serious weight, you know, when you're doing 20 repetitions or 30 or 40. So it's a lot. All right. Here we go. 20 again. Let's see if I can get up. <laughs> Woo! Those were tough. Oh shit. My arms, my chest, my delts, my tricep, everything is feeling mighty pump. I'm really squeezing in the muscles well. Make sure you get a good contraction, good squeeze in those, every one of those re repetitions. And you're gonna be fine. I'm gonna need about a minute and a half to do this last. This is gonna be the last set of push-ups to finish up the routine. Give me a minute and we'll do it together. Last set, wish me luck. Holy man, I'm not looking forward to it. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm a grinder. Here we go, one. but as you can see the last like nine or eight reps didn't quite do a full rep because I felt that I wasn't gonna make it but I still pushed through and got at least a three-quarter rep so whoo if you need to do that man do it oh man all right that is pretty much today's workout I hope you enjoy try it at home it's easy peasy I appreciate all the all the all of you that have been taking a look at the videos, have subscribed up to this point, which is pretty good. Done a couple of videos, already got a few subscribers, which is cool. It definitely motivates me. I appreciate all of you guys. Make sure you like, make sure you comment down below. Anything about the video, anything you like, and at the same time, especially if you're in the same journey, share that with me. And then of course, don't forget to subscribe and put on that bell notification so this way you don't miss out on any on my videos, and I plan to do videos often, as you can see, four or five videos over the last six days. Woo, and it's gonna continue that way. Tomorrow, God willing, shoulders, man. So again, thank you guys. Peace out.